Hey guys, this is Toner, and today we're going to be checking out the new Blue Stacks 5. Now, I'm pretty excited about this because, um, as most of you guys know, I use Blue Stacks uh, quite a bit, and being able to have like the upgraded version that's just so much better is just going to be amazing. Um, there's a few big changes here, uh, massive reduction in stuff like the RAM usage, the CPU usage, and even with like the eco mode on, you've got even more there. It's massive. There's it's better graphics as well. I'm finding like it just runs so much smoother and I'm really enjoying it. Um, you can see here just loading up Strike Force. First of all, it just looks amazing. Um, as you guys all know, I play Strike Force all the time and being able to kind of simulate it on my computer instead of having to run it off my phone or anything just makes it so much easier because I could just sit here with it in the background. And now because of like the new blue stacks, I can just run it while I'm playing World of Warcraft or playing anything else and just have it up there where it's not using all the resources from my computer. I mean, it just looks really smooth as well. You can see here, like it's just, it's butter. <laughs> it's buttery smooth. And I, I really, really like it. I mean, we can have a look at like the gameplay here, go into like one of the raids and um, you can see, I'm just going to check. And now I was running like the low, um, the low graphics mode here. I don't need to do that anymore because it's not, it's not burning up my computer or anything. So let's go in. We're going to go into one of the nodes here. And while this is going, I can talk about it a bit more. Um, so as I said, they've kind of updated it and brought it up to 2021, basically. Um, we've got like the reduction, the RAM reduction in the CPU usage, um, better FPS and stuff while you're well, uh, while you're playing and just overall, I'm, I think it's just buttery smooth. <laughs> um, the other thing is that you've got access to such a massive um, variety of different games on here as well. Obviously, because you've got like access to all the app stores and stuff, um, you can just, I mean, look at the graphics here. Look at how well this is playing. I mean, part of that's due to Strike Force, but without having such a powerful emulator, um, you're just running into issues. And this is just... I mean, I've tried emulate other emulators in the past, and I don't think I'm finding anything that's as, as great as this. Um, I'm I'm just really enjoying the fact that I can just kind of keep um, keep it in the background as well um, to be able to kind of play it while I'm doing other things. It's just really great. Um, so what they're saying is there's basically like a 40% reduction in the memory usage, which is it's crazy um, than any other app store uh, app players or even compared to like your mobile device as well. Um, it's 40% faster as well. You saw how fast I loaded into the game then. Um, even like loading it up from like straight from the, um, like loading up the actual program is incredibly fast as well. Um, Hopefully I'm actually able to clear this note. <laughs> um, the other thing is that it's built in the US, which is really good um, because it means they're up to like the highest security uh, data um, standards and stuff as well. So you know that it's kind of secure. It's got a lot of man hours into it, about a hundred thousand man hours into it. So it's just really, really crazy. Um, the other big thing is that they've added in the, like updated the, um, multi, the multi instance manager. So you're able to run multiple um, games at the same time. So if I wanted to like log into my main account, log into my alt account of strike force, I'm able to, without it kind of completely draining my computer when you've got the eco mode on. Um, see here, it's just, I mean, the, the graphics kind of speak for itself. They're just really great. Um, and like, I can do this while streaming as well on my old computer. I used to have issues where um, any kind of emulator at all would be able to just chew through my computer while I'm streaming. But now I can take this one into my old onto my old computer and just I, I'm going to be able to just run it really easy. So again, like I, I think that this kind of speaks for itself, just how smooth it's running. It's fast, it's high octane action, packs a punch, mega performance upgrade over the previous versions, and it has higher performance um, than basically any Android emulator I've seen around. Um, 
Now, make sure you hit down into the description. There's going to be a link to be able to download it and check it out. Um, I'm I'm really enjoying this. And if you guys want, just check out my other videos. From now on, I'm going to be using this emulator exclusively because it just works so buttery smooth. Um, let me know down in the comments what you guys think. If you're having um, the same kind of success I am, I'm sure that you will. Uh, that's it for today. Have a great day and goodbye.